Oh. All right. Gonna have a front row seat to this next set, though. K Kirby Kid versus Iggy. I actually am not sure what the SM stands for. Uh, uh, I knew this. Do we know what the SM stands for, uh, M? For Iggy? We don't? Okay. Apologies, Iggy. Oh, man. He told me, too, so I feel bad about that. I'll have to ask him later. So, Iggy's probably going to be playing Bayonetta, mm -hmm. which leads me to question whether Kirby Kid is going to... Sorry? What? Okay, Mario so Bayonetta, yep. It'd be Mario and Bayonetta. It's interesting to see if Kirby Kid would be playing Kirby, because this is a slight Kirby. How much? I smell popcorn. Yep. Some, oh, man. They did this last week, too, where they brought popcorn in, and we just had to sit here for like three hours smelling the popcorn. Like, oh, man. Darn. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, it's Tristan. Oh, all the guys working here. Shoutouts to all the people who work here at FX. Yeah, I mean, we definitely keep them here later than their normal uh, <laughs> normal store hours, so it's very, very nice for them you know, to stick around and it's let us It's enjoyable, though, hopefully. Oh, my God! Did, is Let's go! Um, uh, that just happened so. <laughs> Dude, he's gonna do it again! Is he gonna do it? No, nope, does not actually manage to land it this time. Oh my god, if he had done it again, I would have thrown my headset down and walked away. <laughs> Let's go, Kirby Kid! <laughs> oh my gosh, Iggy's, Iggy's having none of that right yeah, now. Yeah, like, that enraged him. That just made him even angrier. I, so let's see here, did Kirby. Uh, apart from the 18% on this stock, has Kirby Kid done a 1%? He may have done 1% with the one tick of up B. Aside from that, no. He has not landed in a single hit. It has been Iggy's game 100%. Yeah. Despite the fact that he is at oh, a wait, deficit because of that up B. Dude, I am... My eyes have been opened. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm so hyped for this now. Okay, Kirby Kid finding a little momentum. Landing a couple of stray hits. He had a shield from Iggy. Kirby Kid trying to hunt the roll away and getting yeah, Ivy instead. It's a good decision by him uh, to not go for anything risky, knowing that yes. if he yes. missed an up B, uh, then he could easily get uh, another combo done on him. Get the objective. All right, here comes another combo. Iggy's normally very, very good at landing those combos, as is uh, Aerolink, our yeah. other Bayonetta player. Yeah, very, very good at. Um Covering as many of the DI options as possible. It's usually, depending on what percent you're at, it's usually 50 50 regardless Ooh. whatever she up you, if she can actually get the follow up, whether or not you know you DI up and in or down and away. But, you know, there, there's some leeway, especially at the Ooh, low wow. and high percents, low percent especially. But. That was like a yep. Falcon up there. That was like a Falcon up there, yeah. So, I think, I think a lot of that came down to Iggy. Being like, all right, I've got this. I'm playing the best character in the game. <laughs> I'm, you know, I'm just gonna go in here and I'm just gonna come right out of the gate swinging. And Kirby Kid, the cerebral player he is, went, uh, uh, uh. You got, you got to think, uh, you got to think twice. Yep. Well, <laughs> definitely thought again after that up B happened and made some adjustments. Still kept a lot of the momentum. Still swung a lot. And managed to have a lot of those swings hit. Kirby Kid though, looking like he's gonna be switching to Pac Man. I don't know if he has some sort of tech for this matchup now. He's got another curveball he can throw Iggy's way. Do we... Is the, is the Pac-Man trampoline glitch out of the game? Because I, I, so. I know it got patched out, and then at one point it got it got back into the game. Did it? <laughs> I did uh, not, not hear about that. Yeah, I don't know if it's... I'm sure it's out. But a tricky with that side B, but Iggy knowing that end lag is going to be a no problem for him to punish. Yeah, the article hitbox on that downer. Gonna... So, Thank God for the Fountain of Dreams music. It's so good. So good. Kirby Kid playing a little bit more defensive, as is standard with Pac-Man. Charging those items, setting up the Hydrant. So, oh, okay. Oh, that was a lot of damage. Wow, and actually getting the side B super deep off stage. Yeah, I mean. Oh, call out on the spot dodge. It's, it's really hard to you know, respect the options when there's no reason to exactly. when you're playing a character like Bayonetta. No. Yeah, which is honestly like a big part of like high level competitive Smash is figuring out just how much you should be respecting your opponent. You know, I guess because you can definitely over respect people. Like you can like you could have set up that safe back air and then just like dashed away and got literally nothing off of that potential, you know, like critical point. But instead getting the the F smash instead. This is looking pretty bad. This is looking I'm not gonna lie. Uh oh. Alright, he's got it. He's got it. Is he going to be? He's got it. No, Definitely. a little bit too far away. 
And just like that. Well, Iggy takes the set. Yeah, Iggy takes the set. I mean, just playing solid all throughout. I mean, Kirby Kid wins the uh, hype moment of the match. Right, yeah. But uh, Iggy's just playing solid through that whole game. Yeah, he definitely did not let that slow him down. Yeah, no. He if said, anything, <laughs> like, like I mentioned, it looked like he was just mad coming down. Yeah, after no. He was like, you think you can do this to me? You think you can just kill me at zero? Do you know who I am? That's what I do to you. I'll show you. <laughs>